Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel, and uh, we're going to talk about the first type of malware that used to be uh, something that was much more of a plague than today, but it's still there, and it still exists, um, and it could be sometimes very difficult to notice that it is actually that, and it's called adware. So adware, what is it? It's a type of malware, so it's a type of virus for really malware. We'll take that general term, and that is present in different forms. So it could reside within your browser. What it does is change the way that your browser behaves and sometimes even change where you're connecting. So you might see a page like this. It says Google. It looks normal. It looks normal on the URL. But when you actually search in it, you might actually be searching through something else without even noticing. And if you notice that the search results seem to be different or don't look the same suddenly, that could be something that is caused by adware. It could be um, software that's running within Windows that's creating ads popping up uh, even on your desktop. Or, once again, modifying the way that your internet connection is going so that there are ads popping up of all sorts. So the adware could be of a adult nature. If you go on adult sites and you start having adult pop-ups, there could be a problem there. Um, it will usually have um, a way to try to lure you into clicking uh, an ad, for example. It might actually even lure you into clicking a um, you know antivirus or an anti um, malware software that it decides that you want to download, but it's not necessarily the real thing. So if you have adware, you might be thinking, oh, I'm going to search for something to remove it, um, and then you will actually be sent to a page that the adware itself is actually wanting you to go. So what you see is not a real antivirus or a real cleaner it is another virus or even something worse. So it's it's a very difficult thing. It, today, in, in, in modern times, adware is less of a problem because there's a lot of mitigation that's been done uh, with, first of all, the sandboxing of the browsers, with the way that now there's check for malicious extensions within these browsers. Um, and, of course... There's um, all sorts of mitigation of pop-ups and pop-unders, that we call. So you might notice that today pop-ups are not frequent. Why? Because most browsers have actually added these features to prevent all of those crappy extra windows from popping up. So adware is less efficient, and so even though it still exists, it's less of a problem today. How do you get adware? Well, same as you would get any type of malware. It could be your email. You clicked something or clicked an attachment that had something that wanted to give you mad, some adware. It could be going on a website, and on that website, you might actually be uh, clicking on something you shouldn't be. Uh, downloading cracks from games, downloading all sorts of software illegally, illegal movies, all of that. This is where you'll get a lot of adware. Um, you could put in the category of adware also um, any website that maliciously pops up all sorts of things when you're there. Um, but it always kind of looks like an ad for something or multiple ads. Um, in the past, there are times when, as a tech guy, I've seen people having so many pop-ups and so many things that actually it was almost impossible to use the internet, because the adware that was present on the machine was there all the time. One of the things that it will often also do is if it's running towards, you know, within the system, one of the things is it might slow it down. It might slow to a crawl your web performance. So if you go to uh, the on the internet and you search or you go on different web pages, 
you might notice that everything is slow. Why? Because you're redirected all the time through other services. Sometimes it's going to give you what you want, but sometimes it's just going to give you way other things that you don't want. And all of that is creating, of course, uh, a slowdown of your PC and a slowdown of the web browser itself. So be careful because even though it's not as bad as it used to be, adware is definitely still there and still exists. Um, and it is something to avoid. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.